Hi guys, it's Monica. Today is day six of Veda and we are making a sloppy joe recipe or barbecue recipe wherever you are from, I guess. I have a pound of hamburger in the microwave. I have some frozen onions that I just took out of the freezer. I have a bottle of Worcestershire sauce to add to my hamburger and some chili powder. Um, there are several different ways. I know you could use manwich or you could do, I've even seen people use barbecue uh, or ketchup and grape jelly, but this is kind of a family recipe that we've used for the last, I don't know how many years, and a good friend of mine made this in college too. So once the hamburger is um, out of the oven, I'm going to start frying on my skillet, which I have out today because I absolutely love this skillet and then we will get rolling. So I will see you guys back in a second. All right, so my hamburger is now browning. I have the onions, the Worcestershire sauce, and the chili powder in here. Um, you know, I was also taught to, the longer the better, you can let your meat sit and marinate in this. It's going to taste delicious. So I might just go ahead and let this um, brown but I'm going to turn it on low and let it simmer a little bit before I drain all of the juices. So if you guys do not have one of these mix and chops from Pampered Chef I highly recommend it. It makes your life so much easier. I am going to uh, put the link below of my co consultant. I was going to say my cosmetologist. No wait that's me. Okay now there's a few ingredients in this that is going to definitely make this recipe pop and that is going to be ketchup and brown sugar right now. So I'm just going to sprinkle now, obviously the sweeter you want it, the more brown sugar you put in. And the less you want it, the less brown sugar you put in. So I'm just gonna squeeze a bunch and then I'm going to let it sit again and marinate. And then we have another step. But this recipe is so delicious, it smells so good you guys. I am on this diet, which I will do for you um, a review tomorrow which has worked. I've lost like four and a half pounds in the last two weeks. So this recipe and this food is not for me. But anyway, so I'm going to stir it up and let it sit some more and then... All right, so now I'm gonna add the last big ingredient and that is a can of chicken gumbo soup. And I thought this was the strangest thing you could ever add to barbecues, but it is delicious. So what I like to do is stir it all in I'm doing this with my left hand, so it's not working so well. I'm going to stir it all in, and then I'm going to steam out the juices. So I'm going to crank it up, get all those juices out, and then it's just going to have this beautiful brown color all around and ready to serve sloppy joes. All right, so I am done steaming it out. Make sure you keep stirring so that you don't burn your hamburger and I'm just gonna put this on warm and I'm gonna let it sit he'll be home in about an hour so the juices should be good and plenty and then I like to serve it just with chips and we're gonna have they're gonna have I should say buns and uh, yeah delicious easy meal um, weeknight meal so I will talk to you guys tomorrow thanks for watching my videos